This fucking hurts. Salutations, all. Salutations, all you lovelies. My name is Equinox, and welcome to the 2019 update video. Yes, I know it's already February. We are updating what is happening on Equinox. Good things, bad things, big things, sad things, everything. All this is happening today, right now. Stay tuned. Get your popcorn. Get your food. Shit's gonna be good. All right. Look, I got a couple things to say, but genuinely, I wanna, you know, do a bit of bit of a bit of a hats off moment. I'm not taking my hat off, but because my head's fucked. But I do really want to do like a whole like serious moment with you guys, and I promise, I promise, I have tons of updates, tons of announcements for what's happening in the channel. We, we'll get to them in just a minute, but I really need to get this off my chest. Just, I, I need to talk with you guys because I never get to do that. And that is a perfect segue into what I want to talk about. I feel like my content, while it's been doing great and we're nearing 1,400 bloody bambinos, y'all are crazy. And that's fantastic. And I always want to improve and bring you all better content and that is where the problem lies. It's taken me a while to notice this, I'll be completely honest. But in me trying to just improve and bring you guys better stuff and stuff that you guys like, I've kind of lost a part of myself creatively. Like, for example, in my streams, if nothing exciting is going on, I will still be overly fucking hyped. Like, I am the most excited person to be there at points in time. I'm not saying it happens often, but I'm not saying it doesn't happen at all because I'm not going to sit here and lie to you guys. Honestly, there are some times where I'm just streaming and I'm streaming just to stream, just to fill the quota. I got to stream tonight. I said I would. We'll get this done. We'll go to bed. We'll work on something great and passionate tomorrow. That mindset is not what I want to have on this channel. And I've never wanted to have it on this channel. Just, I work myself to the bone. I honestly do I didn't notice it the first time when I was literally given a warning by getting physically ill over this. Literally, like, whenever I got sick, the whole Sickquinox update thing, I literally got sick because of how much I work on this. I don't get any sleep. Ever. But I'm also an insomniac, which, I mean, it's four in the morning right now, so we're not working on that very goodly, but still. God, it is really hot in this. Ugh. I love this fucking ring light. You're great. You're my favorite thing ever. But sincerely is the, the TLDR is that I work myself to the bone. But this time, even though I'm not physically sick, I feel like I'm working myself to the creative bone. I feel like it's getting to the point where I'm streaming and I'm just sitting there and just being a character in front of a camera. And it's not gotten that bad yet. There's still me. I'm still there. But I literally feel like if I keep going the way I'm going and nothing changes, I'm going to hit burnout and you're literally just going to turn into Equinox or you're going to tune into Equinox and he's just going to be, oh my God, we're doing so much goofy stuff today. Oh, we'll put the ball. And why that, while that's funny and goofy to laugh at, that's not me. And I don't want to bring you stuff that's not me. I want to be me. And if literally me driving myself to the brink of insanity doing videos is me not being me, then I can't do that. I don't want to do that just because I need to. Just because I feel like I have a quota to get out. I'm done sitting here and making videos because I've got to do it. I'm There's no reason I have to do it. This is not something I do as a job. I have a different... I have an actual fucking job. I only sit here and do it because... I force myself to. I'm not very nice to myself as a person, and I don't think very highly of myself. And all of that culminates into me just getting stuff out there because I've got to and straying away from being genuinely me on this channel. And I don't want to do that anymore. And that is something I'm trying to work on and will be working on in 2019. I'm going to be more myself. So you may see some slight changes in commentary, not too much. I'm still going to be me, and when exciting stuff happens, I'm going to be exciting, and when, or excitable is, I guess, the better word, and I'm going to say stupid funny jokes, because that's genuinely me, 
But I feel like I accentuate it too much sometimes whenever it's not genuine. And I don't want to do that anymore. And I feel like that also stems from me running myself into the dirt with how much I work on this channel for you guys. Honestly, like, I wake up, go to work, come home, YouTube. That is all I do my entire life. And, yeah, Infamous Infernape, if you're watching this, you're right, my dude. I need to chill with that. And I realize I need to chill with that. But I didn't realize that it was affecting me. I realized that I got sick because of it, and I was like, okay, I'll take a couple days off here and there. But I didn't realize that it was making my content suffer. Really didn't. And looking back on some of my videos, they are suffering because of it. Not viewership-wise, because you guys are crazy. Y'all are killing it right now. But quality-wise. And I don't want to bring you stuff that I'm not proud of. You guys deserve better than that, and I intend to give it to you. But I feel like I'm going to go into a more quality over quantity thing. So we're still going to have live streams. We're still going to have videos. And plus, I plan to make more videos and live streams than ever this fucking year. I just want to make sure that I'm not running myself into the dirt. Whenever I stream, I want to have the most fun ever, and I want to be me. I don't want to just be this husk that is literally just performing in front of a camera. I don't want to do that to myself. And if it gets to the point where it might feel a little iffy to not stream, I need to tell myself, we need to not stream today. We need to not do that. And I'm working on that. I'm going to do it. And it's going to be great. And I just, I feel like I needed to tell you guys that. I needed to talk to you guys because I never get to talk to you guys with things. And I just, I want to start talking to you guys more. I like you guys. You guys got nice faces, all of you. And that brings me into another topic. You guys, I feel no matter what I do, I don't connect with you guys enough. And that is going to change. How? I don't know. When? I don't know. But I'm going to find a way to connect with you guys more. Whether it be more vlogs like this or I'm just more responsive uh, to like how I'm actually doing in life instead of just the game and stupid shit that's happening in chat on streams. Gonna be more me. I'm gonna be talking about my life and stuff and being more of a person rather than just sitting there and being a wacky, goofy entertainer at points in time. Because I feel like what I've created on this channel is I've, bl I've made Equinox and I've made Jacob. I feel like I I've said this multiple times. There's an Equinox character, there's a Jacob person. And I feel like whenever my streams are the best is whenever they fuse together and just become me. And most of the time, they're like that. Some of the time, though, and I'm going to be honest here. I've got to be honest with myself and with you guys. I'm not going to lie here. Some of the time, it's not. Some of the time, Equinox comes out and Jacob takes a, a, just a trip down to Fuckville. He just goes to sleep down there. He's a great puppet, so I know. But I don't want to do that anymore. Sometimes, with like the editing streams, you have Jacob. And then with Heart Gold Still Silver, we had Equinox. How about instead? We have Jaquinox the entire time. We just have Jaquinox the entire time. That I just shipped my own name. But, and of course I'm not changing the name, I'm not changing the brand. We are still Equinox till the day I die, because I, I like the name Equinox. I'm a big fan of that. I just want to be more me for you guys, and that's what I'm going to be working on. And I could go in-depth about how I've been feeling and how I feel about life and all the stress that I and the anxiety I have. Maybe, maybe. That's for a different day. That, that may be for a different day. All I wanted to tell you guys is that I'm doing better at being myself. I'm going to be doing better at being myself and making better videos for you guys, not working myself to the bone, and just trying to be better for this community that we've built. Because it's not me. I didn't build this shit. I, I put in the work behind the scenes to make it happen. You guys are the ones that did it. You guys built this with me. I, you guys are just as much the builder as I am, the creator. So... Thank you all, and I'm not going to let you down. I'm going to give you guys the best content I can in the best way possible, regardless of algorithms and stupid bullshit of like, oh, don't do that, that wouldn't do well. I don't care. I'm going to do what I want to do because I want to do it. And I feel like this is a nice fresh start for Equinox, which I know, I know, you've heard so many of those, oh my god, it's 2019, it's the fresh start, yeah, I know, I know, you've heard a lot of that, but genuinely, 
I want to make this a fresh start for Equinox. And I want to do so much more this year, which leads me into the announcements. I know, 10 minutes into a video and EQ is finally getting to the announcements. I know, I'm sorry. I actually already did a take of this and it was 30 minutes long. So just, just take what you can get here. I can't shorten it down anymore. And the announcements are as follows. I have them on this little notepad here because I've got a lot of them. The first things first is Twilight Princess. We're gonna go through the series I have and we're gonna go through a couple new series that I have a plan to do. Twilight Princess. Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess is a game that I have loved since my childhood. And we are currently streaming it on Thursdays on my channel. Thursdays and Saturdays. Why Thursdays and Saturdays? We'll get to that in just a minute. But make sure, if you haven't already, you guys go check that out. It's just, I have so much fun. And it's truly the series that I've been testing out to just play a game because I'm having fun. And not because I think it would, like, you guys would like it. And honestly, you guys are taking a great shine to it. And I'm having the most fun I've ever had playing video games on live streams. <laughs> honestly. And it's great. I'm loving it. Next thing's next. Friday, the day after I stream Twilight Princess, Jerry goes live with Kingdom Hearts 3. Now, this wouldn't matter for my channel if we didn't have a thing called Soul Link Winken. We... Thank you, you did it. If we didn't have a thing called Soul Link Weekend, where what I do is on Thursdays, I stream Twilight Princess 7 p.m. CST. Jerry, the next day, was for Twilight Princess, and I'm there for his Kingdom Hearts 3. So make sure you guys go subscribe to Infamous's channel as well to check out his Kingdom Hearts 3 stream. I'm always there. We're always having a chill time. And then the next day, Saturday, we do what is called... Our Soul Link Weekend. That is the Soul Link Weekend leading up to Soul Link, which we'll get into. Where what we have is in the beginning of the day, probably about, about three or four, maybe five if he's a bit late. Because Jerry's always late. Bone shit. All right. <laughs> Love you, Jerry. Um, we have his Kingdom Hearts stream. We, we play Kingdom Hearts 3 throughout the day, and it's great. Then around 8 to 8.30, we start with The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. So you get two streams back to back in a day. And it's just so much fun. I love Soul Link Weekend, and I'm so glad we thought of that idea. And it's just, it's beautiful. And this will be leading up to the Soul Link we're going to be doing. Pokemon Platinum, or Pokemon Renegade Platinum. It's a ROM hack of Platinum, making it harder. Uh, Soul Link. We're going to be doing, a, this is the first Soul Link I'm ever going to be doing against Infamous, or with Infamous Infernape and myself. Besides, of course, the one episode of Glaze that didn't go well. We don't talk about that. Shh. And it's going to be great. And I know you guys are hyped for it. And I'm really hyped for it too. And what I can say on the graphics is they're coming along pretty nicely. And they look pretty tight. All right. So I can't release anything else. But that is happening. And that is going to be a lot of fun. Um, another thing for another series we're doing is my Pokemon Black Randomizer Nuzlocke. You guys have taken such a shine to actually me posting videos on this channel. And it's such a breath of fresh air. It has been so much fun to just sit down and learn how to record and learn how to edit and learn how to do all this stuff because I've never really dipped my toes into much of that. Learning how to do it has been such a fun experience. I talk about it all the time with my friends. They get annoyed. <laughs> but it's great. I have a lot of fun doing it and I'm glad you guys are loving the outcomes. So definitely stay tuned for more stuff on that. We've got a lot more stuff coming in the future with funny intro moments. I mean, I've already got a couple stacked up because I just think, see something funny and I'm like, that would be a cool intro moment. And we do it. Um, and I guess next up would be the whole video schedule with the whole black. What am I doing black? What is black going to be about? We're going to be doing Pokemon black probably every Monday, Wednesday, Friday. That is the goal. Will it always happen? No. I know that for a fact. There's no way I can do that because I would be working myself to the bone and we just talked about not doing that. So it, the goal is Monday, Wednesday, Friday. And will it have a set time? No, because my internet acts like a potato when trying to render 1080p videos. It just, it doesn't work. <laughs> Fuck you, YouTube's renderer. But it's okay. It's all right. <laughs> they will happen. Um, they will happen just whenever I upload them, I'll upload them. All right. That, that'll be the video schedule. The streaming schedule, I plan to stream a little bit less. Not too much less. I'll let you guys know on Twitter and Discord whenever I am going live. Like the day and about an hour and ten minutes beforehand like I usually do. I plan to stream a bit less, but give you guys better streams and better content. Because 
I want I want to do that. I want to give better content that I'm super duper proud of. And I can't do it if I keep running myself into the ground. So we're not going to keep doing that. Um, finally, the next two things, or the next three things. One thing is huge. You guys are going to love it. And I'm really excited to bring it to you. Um, but next up is members. And this actually leads back from Black and um, the video schedule and all that jazz. Because members will be able to get um, videos early. Whenever you sign up to become a member, it's about five bucks a month. You support this channel and you will get videos early, such as the Pokemon Black Randomizer Nuzlocke. You will also, whenever we get enough members, uh, be ac get access to member-only streams where anyone can show up, but only members can type in chat and you guys can talk to me like that. That's not going to happen for a while. Promise you guys, it's not going to happen for a while. But eventually, I would like to do that maybe one day out of the week. Not something crazy like every fucking time, only members can talk. If you're not a member, you're useless. I'm putting everything behind a paywall. We're not doing that. We're not doing that. I just want to, you know, give back to you guys who support me. And I feel like members was a long time coming. I mean, hell, we hit a thousand two weeks ago. Two weeks ago? Really? It was two fucking weeks ago. Dear God. All right, never mind. It hasn't been that long a time coming. Jesus. Y'all are crazy. Um, but yeah, members, that's a cool thing. There's cool badges. The badges are up on screen. Ba -da -ba -da -ba. And there's cool emojis. More will be added soon. These are just the base ones I have. Ones from my Discord. I'll be adding really custom ones like nut milk and stuff like that. I got some good ideas up in the old dome of mine. And finally, cage lock. We've been throwing that word around multiple times. And I'm only going to tease you on it here. But Infamous Infernape and I... The next series we're doing besides Soul Link will be a cage lock of some sorts. So get excited for that. And one more thing, we basically are at 1300 plus subscribers. Y'all are crazy. And I haven't really been good at keeping up with my whole uh, milestone goals and all that because you guys keep breaking the milestones so quickly. Y'all are lovely, but I don't have time to make these things. However, I do promise that the setup video, the where I show off my setup and what I have and what I use and all of that, will be coming out decently soon. I have a couple things I want to add to my setup to complete the setup before I show it to you guys, but I do want to show you guys what I use, the softwares, the hardwares, the medium wares, <laughs> all of that just to, you know, put you in the put you in my shoes for anyone who wants to like start up YouTube or stuff like that. I mean, you don't have to have everything I have, but you know, it's just it's interesting. I find those interesting and a lot of fun to do. So yeah, that's that's pretty much it. Wait a minute. Oh. Oh, it says we got one more thing on there, ladies and gentlemen. It says that whenever Equinox hits 1,500 subscribers, yeah, that's right, that's the goal, he will be doing a Pokemon Ruby and Sapphire sleep block. Damn, that's gonna be hype. I am excited for that shit, my dudes. So, I'm not gonna touch on anything else with that. I'm just gonna leave that as a teaser for you guys. And sincerely and honestly, thank you. Thank you for listening to me ramble in the beginning. Thank you for getting excited for these announcements. Thank you for showing up to the stream, showing up to the video, showing your love and support on this channel. Recently, y'all have been killing it. It's been insane. And I can't wait to bring more stuff to you guys in the future. And I'm so excited for 2019. We're going to make this the best year for Equinox. Guarantee. All right. Make sure you guys subscribe to my friends in the link in the description. We got Crimson Kramer, Nazarog Gaming, Shiny Suicune, Fiery Dance, who's our killer graphics artist. And we've got tons of other people. TJ, we've got Video Games and Chill. We got Short Temper Tobin. I don't know him too well, but he's still tight. I love that, dude. We got tons of people. And I will put all their links in the description unless I forget a couple. If so, I'm so sorry. But they're awesome. Go check them out. They're fantastic. This friend group we have is beautiful. And just get excited for everything that we've got in the future. Like, fuck everything Equinox has in the future. Get excited for what we all have in the future. This friend group and community is going to explode with ideas and content. It's going to be beautiful. And I am so excited for what is coming in the future. So, until then... My name has been Equinox, and here's to a bitch-ass 2019. Peace.